So, Katie and I have been engaged since June 5th, I believe. The day we got Mac. Well, she was engaged to Mac. Mac if proposed. If I remember correctly. Uh, Mac proposed. It was a proxy proposal. Okay. So, he proposed for me. Okay. He did it in my proxy. Um, she knew. So, we thinking about planning the wedding gave us stress. Sure. Like, if I said, like, right. hey, we should probably start thinking about this. That was like instant. We both got stressed and like, right? Because we both didn't want a wedding, a big wedding. I mean, we're fairly which close. Which really I... bums my mom out because I'm like, mom, like, we want to be married. Like, the wedding is just right. a four hour event. Yeah. Because I kept saying we just want to get it over with. And she like was like, ah, I hate when you say that. I'm like, well, right. it's just that, like, the right. day. It's like, currently the... weighing on you. Yeah. So, I mean, I saw the three time cycle where you guys went from. Like, initially engaged to, like, okay, yeah, maybe a wedding. And then it was, like, well, way too many people, a lot of money, kind of not into it. Let's take some time off. It's too much money. And then it was the cycle kept happening where it was, like, wanted to be small, but family and people, it, it turns yeah. into a lot real quick. And COVID so. was tough. And, like, you know, if if one ant comes, then all ants oh, have to yeah. come. Like, that's, yeah. like, I'm pretty fair that You're way. You're trapped there. Yeah, and I got a big family and, like, yeah, I mean, even you know. if you do siblings, you guys are deep. Yeah, like it's a, like just like larger than ideally you thirty probably people. Would have wanted. I think it's twenty five people if we did like just nucleus. Yeah, if everyone's significant others. Well, because I have six plus four ten, and then two nephews. That's twelve. Oh yeah, if you start counting kids of your siblings, Katie has. Yeah. Four, five. So we're at like seventeen twenty. Yeah. Which you know is a dinner party. Yeah, I mean that's a that's and an that, event. And that's just nucleus. Yeah. So we were going to Katie was like, let's just elope. Like, let's just elope. We'll have a party in the summer when everyone can have come and maybe he's vaccinated. Like that. I was like, cool. I was like, tell me Bang. she's like, I'm gonna set the date. I was like, I'll ask you tomorrow morning. Yeah. And we'll see like if you're still on this plan. Yeah. And she was. But then we wanted to get married before Christmas and then have it be a surprise Christmas Day. Right. Surprise. Surprise. We're married. married. Our present to you is we're married. Right. But, like, we couldn't do that in time with the courts and stuff. Right. So then I think on the 26th or 27th, Katie texted me. We were all sitting around. She's like, let's get married on the 1st. I was like, yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Dang. My mom pointed out when she saw getting married on the 1st really makes the tax aspect of it very easy. Oh. We did not think of that, but that is awesome. So apparently, oh. I guess whenever... April 2022, you'll be really happy you picked that day, I guess. Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah, that's awesome. Well, Thanks. you know, it's just kind of, Mrs. it's like, D. cool, it's like New Year. We're married now. Yeah. Anniversary is easy, not during yeah. baseball season. So, like, we can, and we can <sighs> go somewhere warm every winter. Yeah. That was, like, a big thing. Obviously, we work baseball season. If I didn't work, right. I would take off the week and celebrate. Right. But like, you know, we work. Baseball yeah. season, it's and you never know what's going to happen during. So whatever, that was like a big thing. So now we can just and it's like New Year's. New Year sucks anyway. Yeah. So now we can go to a warm climate place with our kids or whatever down the road and enjoy it. Occasion. You have a permanent excuse to not like go to someone's New Year's party. Yeah. Go out with someone. So it's going to be a big secret. Like I, we weren't going to tell anyone. I was going to drop it on you. Right. On this. On the ideally on, Monday, yeah. I'm talking Yanks. Yeah. How was your weekend? And I was gonna say yeah. got married, and then you were gonna be like, "What?" Yeah. And but because of COVID and because it's a holiday, we needed to provide our own witnesses. Right. You and Jess were gone. Right. Um, Dead. I didn't want to do a stranger because if I told my mom like a stranger got to be there right. and like they didn't, I your think tears. that's yeah. And I and we didn't want to do like Katie's like out about our neighbor and I was like well anyone that's no like, right but it sucks Katie's parents couldn't come right because they're in California so it's like now it's it's really shitty feeling and, and I, we felt terrible but we asked them and they said it was okay and so then my parents were the witnesses yeah which was nice but it would have been nice to have like the nucleus there yeah but COVID you know so we went to the courthouse it was like an hour away Katie got dressed I dressed up yeah like, we did all that good. stuff we got the little flowers and the bouquet um and then we drove to like we drove together to the courthouse. Yeah. And got married. It was really quick. There was a nice little whatever she called the the efficient. You've like, got a good no teeth smile. I don't have that in my bag. Yeah. It's gentle. I don't have a good teeth smile. I think I try to do too much with it. Mine's like people yeah. are like, oh. That's like a face you make. Don't do that. 
That's your a smile attempt? It doesn't look like a smile attempt. It looks like you're trying to be creepy. I know. <laughs> I know, man. I don't have that in the bag. Uh so uh, so then, yeah, we, it was quick, like five minutes. We, we had a Zoom for the family members, and then we didn't give anyone the option to record it, which was our bad. My mom thought she was recording the whole ceremony with her phone. She sure. never hit record. Yeah, um, that's obvious. So we don't have any video. But we have pictures. I took some home videos. I love home videos the way we used to watch home videos. Yeah. Just like. You just, it's like a random cut. Like it's five seconds here of dad, like showing the presents. Right. And then, then, and then it just jump cut to the kids opening the presents. Like, yeah. Cause that's how we grew up. That's how, so I did the day, like day of, like it was like Katie putting on her makeup, me like hanging out with Mac and I'm going to just put them uncut together in like a five minute home video nice. and then just save that for like 10 years, 20 years for like our kids or whoever. It's very small though. Cause I didn't do a lot, but I think I'm going to do that. Cause right now, like. You don't have home videos. You just have these 10 second right. Instagram stories, five second clips that get sent out. Or like fully done videos. Yeah. So yeah. I think I'm going to try and like, on like Christmases, just do old school style videos to I save like them. that. Yeah. No editing. Mix it up. And you just watch them. So that was that. Then we went, we went out to lunch. Uh, my sister and Brett came and in New Hope, Pennsylvania. NHPA. Yeah. Wow. New Hope, Pennsylvania is right on the Delaware River. It only exists because you, when people would travel from Philadelphia to New York, it was like right in the middle before mm. you crossed the river. So people would spend the night and then cross the river in the morning. So a town formed. Town formed? But it's like a cute little town. And then we went home and we took like a really nice nap. And then Brad and Peyton came, friends from California. And that's, that's the wedding day. Like that. Happy for you. Thanks. It was nice. We're we are very happy. Like obviously, we wish our parents could have been there, sure. um, and all of our siblings. But we're very happy. 